It's all a collective effort. That is a fantastic way to sum up this game mode, right guys? Hey, th this is providential right here. What is going on guys? It's Zigzag here. Welcome back to another GeoGuessr video. Today we are on Twitch, live with a bunch of viewers here, as you can see, and uh, we're gonna be trying the new co-op bullseye mode. Uh, which I actually know nothing about apart from what it says on the description here. So let's let's open this up and uh, let the people trickle in. And uh, I thought there was like a rule. So oh yeah, here we go. How to play. Okay, so guess with the circles. So guess using a circle. A correct guess will turn green for you and your teammates. Use the information to narrow down the exact location. Okay. The size of the circle depends how many points your team will get. Are you unsure? Place a larger one. Or risk it. Okay, so we, we're trying to get as many points as we can. We'll use a bigger circle if we want to play safe. We'll use a small circle if we think we know exactly where it is, okay? I've not, again, I've not seen any gameplay of this yet. Feeling lost or need help? Teleport to a friend's location and see if they found any good clues. Okay. Okay, this is interesting. So here are our six teammates. We've got Finn, Kodiak, Brendank, Chris, and Elokog. So let's click start game and see what we got going on. So game starting in 3, 2, 1. We got Diverse World. Let's see. Okay, so here is the team. We got we got a communal score here. Uh, so I would suggest looking at this one. Looks like Eswatini, possibly South Africa. No moving, no. Yeah, I think these wooden poles may be more common in Eswatini. I could easily be Umbabane, but other cities are possible. So let me think. So if I want to make an ultra-sized guess. Uh, so, okay, so it's not in there, not in there. Okay, so oh, interesting. So not Eswatini then. Uh, so if it's so hilly, maybe north and South Africa, or maybe maybe even around Durban or something like that. So I think I'll make an ultra-sized guess right here. Okay, so no, it was Eswatini, so I wonder why I only just turned green. Um, wrong guesses are red. Okay, so I guess... Oh, oh, you need to press guess. I see, I see. Uh, so we, we can forget about that. We can, we can make a smaller type of guess over here. Um, so... Oh, does everyone get one guess? I'm assuming everyone gets one guess. Let's, let's take away the map and see... So Finn's made his guess. Uh, so I guess like now we should get uh, Chris to do the Mbabane guess, I guess. Um, I think that would probably be best. Um, so it's not an Mbabane. So that is a good thing to know. I think Manzini might be the second biggest town. So maybe uh, some someone should guess in Manzini. I think that might be the second biggest town. I can't quite remember. So if someone wants to go there. Okay, so... Ooh. Okay, so you can actually do a marker. How does that work? Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what that flashing purple was, actually. Okay, so we haven't we got we got another one here around Manzini somewhere, presumably. Okay, so looking to our south, we have big mountains. It seems like a lot of the town is over to our maybe southeast here. So I want to guess like um, northwest of the town. So somewhere up here with a what is what does a medium type guess look like? Okay, so. Wow, my ultra guess is still there. Okay, I still have it set to ultra, so maybe I need a tiny. What what size is a tiny? Okay, tiny's that big. So I, I was thinking somewhere up here, maybe. Uh, but actually, probably bullseye is probably what we need. Okay, so bullseye is a bit too small, though. So the difference between tiny and bullseye is quite large. So I guess we could use some triangulation if I guessed here. So I think I'll do that. So let's go there. Okay, so it's not inside that zone where I guess. So now we need someone else to come in and, uh, well, it says we've got 5,000 scores so far, so it seems like we are on the money somehow. Okay, so everyone's guessed apparently. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, so here we were. We're actually surprisingly close. We get, uh, we got it inside of a tiny circle, so we get 4,000 points. Okay, let's start next round. I think, uh, we kind of get the idea there. Okay, so next one. Let's take a look around. We've got a blue strip. We've got a section pole. Uh, perhaps, I'm actually not quite sure here, let's look for some language, perhaps Italy? Oh no, not Italy, we don't have an Italian plate, so, what was I thinking here, maybe Portugal or Spain? I think Spain or Portugal, maybe Portugal makes the most sense here. Um, so, who will take the, uh, who will take the guess first and, and do a bigger, bigger guess over in Portugal? Interesting, so looking at this language, yep, certainly looks like it could be Portuguese to me. And this, this poll definitely looks Portuguese, so I think so. Okay, so I think I think it would be good. Well, that's the thing. If we're playing small like this, I guess I guess it's a good idea to just do what we're doing here and and do a bunch of small guesses. Um So yeah, I guess I guess maybe you guys do up and down the coast like that. 
uh, unless anyone has like a particularly good idea. Okay, so um, we are inside this zone over here, so that makes things nice and easy. I'm gonna switch over to a small, and if I'm a small, then I can guess Lisbon area, and uh, that should like, we should be able to get this area, I'm assuming. So I'm gonna hit guess here. And okay, it is, with inside, it is inside the Lisbon area here, so now people can start to get more specific. So if we look to our north, we see quite a bit of like infrastructure, quite a bit of town. If we look to our south, we also see some significant apartment buildings. So let's see, people are thinking of doing like a bit of a Venn diagram thing here. I think that would be a good idea. Who's that? Who's that in the yellow there? I think Brendank, that would be a good idea to uh, do like a Venn diagram guess over there, just so we can uh, safely say that we're inside that area. Otherwise, we could just go for a small guess. Okay, so we are indeed inside this uh, inside this little eye shape here. So now the next person move in and go for a particular guess. I'm not really sure if north or south is more likely, but I do see like a lot of building to the north. So maybe maybe somewhere above above Lisbon proper would be a good guess here. That's my that's my thought. We found the town. How do we found the town? Town. Okay, so apparently, oh wow, we've so we got these. Um, town names and we've actually found one of them here for sure this one here it's unfortunately it's kind of hard to read because of all the green but yeah al al mornos is on this sign here where's bispe don't think i see bispe but apparently apparently this is a decent guess so if al mornos was kind of up into the up into the east of us so maybe maybe if we were a little bit yeah like more around here I, don't, I can't, it looks like I can't, but I, yeah, I think a good, a guess around here would be a good idea. Now, how are people um, signaling? Can someone tell me how to signal? Okay, so seems like, I mean, we were right very close to it, but unfortunately we missed out on the score. So that's rather frustrating that it was only a small circle that time, but I guess it was a bigger country than Eswatini. Okay, so interesting. I'm not really sure um, what our tactics should have been differently there. I think we maybe should have gone for the next size down, but after you've guessed, you can ping. Okay, so I'll keep that in mind for next round. Okay, here is the next one. We got a shy antenna. We got hills in the background. Uh, we have on this EU plate an F, so it should be France, uh, given that fact. Uh, but we've got yeah, we've got double blue on this number plate, so that would also check out for France. And so somewhere southern, presumably uh, somewhere over here. So I, I quite like that guess. I think also a guess like this, maybe a medium-sized guess. Or maybe even a small guess. Yeah, the difference between small and medium is big here. But I think even just like a like why a little guess like this, like what I've got here, would be very likely to cover it. So we are indeed inside that um, circle that um, the purple guy, who is Elacog, has made. And so I'm thinking of a bit of triangulation like this. So I think that would probably be most useful, the most of the useful thing I can do here, because I don't see any town name or anything. Uh, so I think I'll go for the triangulation guess like this. Okay, so we're not inside that area. So that actually leaves quite a small portion of France that we can be in, which is actually going to be quite useful for the team. But don't be afraid to go into the red a little bit, guys. Then we can actually cover more of this area around Nice and to the north. So in the meantime, let me take a look for any clues uh, to help them out. Kodiak goes in, and it appears to be somewhere around Nice. I, I would suggest a a like a small circle... Uh, could be in order here, um, somewhere around Nice or somewhere around Gap there, um, because probably around Lyon is not quite mountainous enough. So we're kind of left with a smallish, like a uh, little isle of land here, which is pretty good. I think the uh, the Venn diagram technique is definitely definitely what's in order, right? Okay, okay. This is development, guys. We are with indeed within this sector, and now the question is: Is there anything? more to say is there any like proper clue that we can get so we can move to the tiny circles so yeah i kind of like this guess that uh yellow's got going on who's yellow again i kind of like bren dank's guess like that uh but i think let's just get the guesses in before we uh, start the next round guys so i, I, I I'm, I'm i'm satisfied to just uh go for the, these guesses uh so it's not there and uh yeah we miss out that's unfortunate it was right oh man that's that's very painful that it was right outside of uh, kodiak's guess there unfortunate indeed it's always going to be very difficult. Imagine if it was here, though. If it was here, then both of them would have been red and we would have gone searching over here. So that would have been super tough. But <laughs> regardless, we can move on to the next one here. Okay, so this one looking rather Colombian. And of course, we do have a yellow plate here. So this is good. Also, we can use um, Twitch chat's help here. If you guys want to help out, 
that would certainly be in order um, if you guys have any particular thoughts. But let's see, everyone is definitely thinking of Colombia. I think those two guesses, maybe uh, moving a little bit further to the west so that it covers Cali as well, and then it would be a pretty safe, like, two hedger. Um, yeah, like that. I feel, I feel like I feel like if it's not in those two circles, then, well, it's not going to be anywhere, right? It could also be in the south here. Okay, so we are indeed within this green. That's a really good start. Unfortunately, because it's so rural, um, it's going to be very difficult to actually get a precise guess here. Okay, so let's see what people are thinking. Okay, so Pris certainly has this thought that it might be over here. So I wouldn't mind, Kodiak, if you want to go in for something like that and then type in chat. Near a river, probably. So, okay, so that thought was incorrect. So maybe over near Bogota. Yeah, I'm going to go for a small guess. So the Bogota is also wrong. So, hmm. A lot of the times, I think when you get to this small zone, that is where the real challenge is. We are definitely within this green zone. So, yeah, maybe around Medellin. Okay, so not this zone. I don't know if this was a great guess, though, because we definitely see mountains uh, in the background. Or do we? Actually, no, may maybe it was a fine guess. I, I just kind of got the feeling that it was a mountainous spot. Oh, Yopal was over here, so... Yeah, Kodiak was thinking in this section of the country. I mean, it still could be. You never know, it could still be in this zone here. That would be painful. Oh man, that's real painful. Kodiak was indeed right, and his guess was so close. So we get only a medium circle, which is only 2,000 points. And yeah, that's pretty painful. That is pretty painful indeed, but uh, okay. Guys, guys, uh, let me know in the chat. What are you guys thinking of this game mode? Do you guys rate it or not? Oh, look at this interesting round. White center lines. I think this might be... Well, these pipes are these pipes are Mexican flavor pipes. If you get what I'm saying, they look Mexican. So I guess we're in Mexico. Oh yeah, this is really cool round. So my initial instinct is yeah, somewhere where these guys are clicking. Let's switch over to medium. Something like this would make sense, I think. Um, so I think where I'm where I have my guess here is probably pretty safe. Yeah. Okay. So Baja California is completely cleared out. I think my guess here would make sense. Now it could be further south. Mexico City area is pretty notorious, but I'm going to go here. Okay, so it's not, so it should be Mexico City area. So someone put a medium down near Mexico City, and then we can start working from there. We're kind of running northeast, yeah, Mexico City uh, to be expected. What about something like this, where we're like running through a mountain pass, something like that? Kind of feels like National Park-ish, like that or that. Hmm, okay, so yeah, I don't mind that, State of Mexico. Because it, it feels, it, to me, off the bat, it felt north of Mexico City, but... I'm not really sure. So Mexico City area to the east is cleared out. I like your guess, Yellow. I think go for the guess. We can speed it up a little bit because it's a no-moving game. I don't mind if we go a bit, more, a bit more quickly. So, okay, that's also incorrect. So are we between the boobs, you know? Are we between them? That is the question. Because if, if, it, if it's that again, then that's going to be sad. <laughs> um, Kodiak's thinking of us Oaxaca. Oaxaca. Um, <laughs> and other guys, I don't know, let's just go for some guesses here, guys. And, uh, I said, does the last guy not get to guess? I don't really understand, but his guess would have been the best, so he should have. Um, it was a, it was a team effort, but the top scoring circle was placed by, oh, so he'd placed the middle one there. That's right. Okay, so everyone placed it, and, uh, we started off strong in Eswatini, uh, because we got Manzini, and we almost had it, really. It was a really, uh, nice try there. Uh, and then it kind of went downhill from there, but to be fair, we did get bit of bigger countries. Um, oh, he guessed, but very small. No, 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 he, he guessed the big circle because he was the closest. He, get, he guessed the big circle. Uh, anyway, uh, let's go on to another one. Uh, I think if I press play again, will it be the same people? Oh uh, yeah. Oh, is it, it's different people this time. Great. Um, wait, if, if guys who plays before made to leave so we can have new people in. So Kodiak and Elakog. Uh, if we could have, and, and Chris. Oh no, Chris was in it? Yeah, yeah, so new guys, new guys come in. Oh uh, yeah, I'll, I'll put the link in as well for anyone who's just tuned in. There you go. Okay, so we got new guys in, and uh, goodbye Kodiak, good to have you along. And uh, also to you as well, Finn. Winston, Winston, Will, Wilson, Lululu, good to have you along. Um, Why fast too slow, damn. I feel the struggle, Australian internet, like, before I got MBN, it sucked so bad, so I really feel your struggle. Trust me, I really do. Uh, so let's go again with no moving. This time, is there a way to put time limit? Anyway, let's just guess faster this time. Let's try and, like, go a minute per round. So Abu Dhabi uh, is to our north, east here. 
let's get it going quickly guys let's get it going quickly um so i'm gonna start off with a small circle if it's to our northeast surely we are in something like that so i'm gonna start off there okay so abu dhabi uh so we're on the 44 here so presumably it actually could be further north um i just got the feeling but it's actually yeah, i got the feeling but um that it would be to that direction but you can see this actually bends all the way around so my guess was not fantastic so maybe i guess up in dubai would actually be more in order here uh so someone else go for like a the similar size as what i did actually no i think where i guessed yeah yeah they don't have official coverage there i only realized my guess was silly after the fact unfortunately okay so people are trying to pinpoint here i like this should be on some like fairly central highway thing i think this looks like it works here this 44 section here if anyone wants to give that a go because look at how this spins around we got like massive we got like massive circles so okay so it appears to be somewhere within this zone here i kind of like this i kind of like this section here or this section here like one of these two i think that would make sense so if anyone wants to go for a small guess there you can but i guess there are a lot of these different ones like that uh, we need one with the number 44, and this one does indeed have the 44. Does it also have the 73? Uh, I don't know. The D, the D73. There's the D71, 72, 72. Where's the 73 at? Because it wasn't there. Where's the 73 at, guys? 69? 72 again, so 73 should be findable here, surely. Okay, so here it is, here it is. Uh, so someone guess put put our last guess there. I think it's gonna be there, uh, and 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 we're kind of entering from the south of it. So maybe like right there, I guess. But that makes sense. I'm not quite sure actually. To be honest, my guesses haven't been that good. But you can actually see that the bend in the road to our south is actually correct. So I think we should be around here, around here. Yeah. Someone go for someone go for the smaller one, and then someone go for the precise one. Okay. So we got five thousand points. Let's go. Uh, a really nice little 5k by Artem there. Fantastic, fantastic. And uh, we hit the bullseye. Let's go. And we, all we needed was the exact, uh, <laughs> all we needed was the exact right signs. Okay, so here we have Fuchsia Road. We are Gen 2, so we're South Africa. It's all a collective effort. That is a fantastic way to sum up this game mode, right guys? Hey, th this is providential right here. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, let's check it out. We got fairly green looking place here. I, I would expect this to be like, Somewhere between like Durban and Pretoria. So let's see what medium, medium will get us Durban and Pretoria. So if someone wants to start us off with one over there, uh, the, like over there, then that would, that would be a good start. I think if one that captures Durban and Pretoria. Okay. So we are indeed within that area. I, I would say because it's more flat that, uh, Johannesburg and Pretoria are more likely. We have blue on the number plates, but I'm pretty sure both of those, uh, territories use blue. Yeah, yeah, this is an epic thumbnail. This is an epic thumbnail. It's all a collective effort. <laughs> I love that. I love that. We're definitely using that for the thumbnail. Uh, regardless, we are indeed in the Joburg area. So let's see if we can find Future Road. Club density, foam party. It's got an admission, but it's got no suburb name or anything like that. So we're on an east to west road here. Oh, what does this say? Ooh, Clipsprit West. Oh, let's see if we can find that. Clipsprit. Clips for it. Should be fairly. Oh, Krugerdorf. No, I, I swear I saw something that was similar here. Clips for it. We could certainly find. It's not coming up on mine. Let's say let's say uh, thirty or forty more seconds here if we can if we can find this place. Oh, Clip Fontaine. Okay, that's that's that that does uh, that does inspire some confidence. But it looks more built up, so maybe further up this direction. I don't know. It could certainly be out there. Oh, there's lots of fontaines, isn't there, in South Africa? Anyway, clips per it. I think. Oh, oh, I found it. I found it. Okay, so let me go go do a small one, a tiny one over here. Oh, let's go there. Okay, so it's not there, but guys, this is this is where it is. It has to be somewhere around here. So let's see if we can find the right uh, name of the road. It was Fuchsia, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, Fuchsia Road. So what is this one? What's this one called? Maybe it's not quite right, but it has to be somewhere over here, guys. Oh, and that- <laughs> what? Oh no. You're lying to me. What was lying to me? Clipsprit West? I guess, I guess this, uh, this is not- this is the Clipsprit East and this is the Clipsprit West. Why are you naming the, the, the suburbs the exact same thing? I can't believe it. <laughs> anyway, um, so Fuchsia Road, has it been found? 
Surely we can find Fuchsia Road. Oh, uh, there's Chris Harney Road. Coma Road. We're going east to west, so it shouldn't be that hard to find, surely. Clips for it Valley. So Chris Harney, I don't really know what this is about Fuchsia Road, but um, people seem to think it's all around here. So maybe someone go for the next size smaller. I don't know if that is the next size smaller, but yeah. <laughs> Everyone chucking the walls in chat. I, c I can't believe I actually found the wrong one. That's actually so rough. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's get let's get our guesses in, guys. Let's get our guesses in. Somewhere around here. Okay, so it wasn't on that side, so it has to be somewhere over here. Fuchsia, I don't see. That's the problem. Fuchsia, I don't see. No. What about to the south here? Fuchsia, I do not see, man. That's kind of strange, but I, I guess I guess just go where you have it, Pisanico. Um, or something like that. So we can end off the round here. I don't really know. It, it, it feels like it's going to be somewhere around there. Somewhere, it was somewhere on an intersection like this, maybe. I don't know. I can... Is there a way I can hit end round? I can. So, okay. Let's see how close we were. And, okay. So, not a bad effort overall. Pisanico's guess was pretty close. And Fuchsia Road... Does it exist? Yeah, it does. Okay, it's just a very tiny road. Okay. Uh, yeah, I do think we need a time limit. I'm not sure if there was an option for that. But anyway, we got Tiny Circle that round. So that's pretty good. We're actually on a really good score here. Um, I'm not really sure what like the record is for this. But I'm assuming some better players have, have done a really good job so far. Anyway, this one is tough. Uh, Brazil. Healy. So I already like... I already like going up here, personally. I already like a small guess around here or a medium guess around here just to just to remove that possibility because it's just so hilly and that's kind of like what you see around here so i'm gonna go for that okay so it's not up there yeah since host can end the round it doesn't really matter okay so we're gonna we're gonna go faster this time guys okay so let's get a let's get a nice big guess in here uh so pisanico is actually thinking more southern here which would make sense it is very like green and lush but it's not southern so where else do you get these little hills? I, I still think it's going to be Amazon, I guess. Acra might have a few hills in it. Um, I think this is Amazon, though. It definitely appears Amazon to me. But it is, it is very green. So it could be like on the Bolivian or the Par like I guess on the Bolivian or the Peruvian border, something like that. Um, yeah, Acra. Where's Acra? Oh, Acra's over here, isn't it? I forget. Yeah, Acro's over here, so that's that's kind of what I was thinking. Okay, so let's get another guess in. Crazy Creepy, you can guess there. Yeah, yeah, go for Acro. Go for Acro. Yeah, that's a, that's a nice guess. Just like, yeah, 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 that's good, that's good. Just somewhere over there. Okay, so not Acro. I mean, it could be. It could still be over here or something. That would be very painful. But uh seems like it's not, so I think we need to at least get a, a, a good guess in here. So maybe someone go for a bigger, bigger guess. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Let's just get him in within the next 30 seconds, though. Get him in within the next 30 seconds. So, Wins Win Wilson actually thought uh, Northern Coast. Which would actually make sense if it was a bit hilly, but... I don't know. It's very green, though. That's the thing. It is very green. Yeah, this this round is not going well. We had a really strong start, but this round is not going well. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I cannot believe that that was so coastal. And we had zero points. I was so confident for up here. So there we go, that was our first ever zero. <laughs> I mean, it looks kind of cool how we did it, but that's a really tough round, and we were, we were very unlucky because as soon as we have this wrong guess here, it's very, like, it's not tempting at all to go right there, so zero points, that's a bit of a fail. Okay, let's see what we got up go, going up next. Uh, we got white car, like, it looks to be Indonesian architecture, I would have thought. Um, we got a motorbike, no license plate on the front, very naughty, but... Uh, yeah, it should be Indonesia or Malaysia. I'm assuming Indo. Yeah, we literally guessed. Uh, we literally guessed seventy five percent of Brazil. Okay, so where's that? Um, okay, so um, this is what uh, Soviet spy thought. Soviet spy thought it's somewhere over here. Um, so I guess I could go for a medium around there. Uh, that wouldn't be a bad guess. I feel like it is very green. I associate these ones with being a bit more um, dry, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think, I think, I think going for a big circle straight away is a good idea. So I'm gonna go for a large one uh, for Sulawesi and the Tangaras. So let's see if that's right. Okay, so it's not Sulawesi or the Tangaras or Timor Leste. Uh, so that is pretty helpful. Hopefully, it's not over here. 
maybe I should have planned that a little bit better, but um, yeah. Okay, so let's let's get a bigger guess perhaps over. Let's get the whole of Java. Let's get the whole of Java done here. Oh, uh, you, you could you could go a little bit further over here. No, no, no. Use a bigger guess, Crazy Creeper, and go like go like here or something like that. Okay, so we are indeed within Malaysia. That that is not surprising. I mean, within Malaysia or um or Indo. That's not surprising. Should be Indonesia. Crazy Creeper, do your guess. Okay, okay, it is Malaysia or Indonesia. Okay, I was not expecting this to be Malaysia, but I guess looking back on it, it kind of makes sense. These houses could certainly be Malaysian. Do we have any black? Oh, we do have, we, we just had a black plaque on the uh, pole the whole time. Look at that. I did not realize that. So yeah, we are in Malaysia. Uh, so maybe, so maybe Southern? I don't know if it's gonna be Southern or Northern, something rural. I don't really know. But yeah, I guess go for some plonks now, guys. Uh, we just need a good plonk. Something, yeah, northern or southern would make sense. I don't think it's going to be around KL. Okay, so there we go. It was northern, actually. Uh, and did someone actually say that? So, I don't think anyone, um, actually said that, but it's actually very similar to what uh, Soviet spy initially said. Um, <laughs> Ong, what, what, what is the, uh, what is the, how, how, how do you feel about that guess? Not the best from us. We get 2,000 points at least. So, uh, did you actually say the actual exact right place there, Soviet? What's it called? Te te Terenganu. I was thinking you meant, um, Terengara. I think you said Terengara. Hmm. Um. Okay, let's see what we got going on in the next round. We're at a border crossing here, it appears. Uh, I haven't even looked around yet, but I think this looks like, well, I was going to say it looked like Arj, but this is not an Arj car. So, Rio, Colorado? Is this Mexico or Colombian? Oh, it looks like, looks to be Colombia, I think. This, this shape here looks like the, like, river mouth. No, I don't know. I guess not. Where is this, actually? I kind of thought that like outline looked a little Colombian, but now that I look at it a little, little bit closer, it doesn't. So this should be like the sta a state outline of some kind. Okay, we're actually all confused by this. Everyone's everyone's thinking about different things here. But okay, we got the white car with the antenna, which is interesting. Um, it says something very helpful, but I can't quite read it. Uh, okay, so where where are people guessing? Okay, so oh, would that make sense? So. Oh, Pisanico is very confident, but okay. So let's get a let's get a small guess over here, I guess. But this is really what he thinks, so I guess we'll go for it. Okay, so he is right. So there's the Rio Colorado. It is actually a town here, and St. Louis as well. I think we also saw. So we need a border crossing somewhere around here. If someone wants to go for that. Um. So where else would can you cross the border? I guess. So I guess the next one is over here. So this would make sense, I think. Of where I'm clicking right now. Yeah. Uh, so let's see. That would be a east to west crossing, roughly speaking. Okay, it is. It is roughly speaking an east to west crossing. Kind of. I think that's the right angle. Uh, so yeah, I think I think go for a booze, I guess, around here, and then if it's not there, I guess we can we can we can re regroup and gather our thoughts. But yeah, I think go for that crazy. Sorona and Baja California. I don't know what Sagapa is. Yuma is the American town, so it's not that border crossing. Okay, sorry about that. So I wonder. Okay, it could be. It could just be Mexicali. I think we need like someone to do like a medium or or a small guess on Mexicali here. I think that would probably make sense. And this is the same river as well. I think. Let's see what it says. Okay, it's not even going to tell us. That's a canal actually. Colorado River. Yeah, Rio Colorado. Okay, so someone. Okay, so not Mexicali. This is painful. So where is the next border crossing? Oh no, <laughs> we missed the international border crossing. Someone, someone, oh, well, it's not east. It's not north to south though. That's the problem. Is it? I don't know. Look at this one here. It's very close. If it's not there, then, oh, this one. Okay. So yeah, I think, I think that one makes more sense actually. Rio, Colorado. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be this one. It should be this one here. Um, I, I was I was getting caught up about the fact that he just missed this border crossing right here, bro. But yeah, I think I think it should be the one on the Rio Colorado over 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 where I'm marking right now. So I think purple guy, who's purple guy? I think uh, Artem, you should go for that. I'm pretty sure. Well, is he correct though? Yeah, we got it. We got it. 
Oh, so it's not even that one. Yeah, yeah, that actually makes sense. I, I was thinking that the angle looked a bit wrong. And uh, there we go. We actually found it. And it was actually quite on the border. So that is why we were having some trouble. But we get it. Very nice guess. Better than what I was thinking. And so we end up with 16k. So what was the last one? Do we remember? Do you remember what the last one was? Like 14k or something? So I think that was an improvement. I think it was. Border crossing from mechs to mechs. Word. So what was this actually? Maybe you have to like do something there before you get over. But look at this. We had two bullseye guesses. Epic. Epic. Anyway, I'll sign off from YouTube. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this uh, game mode, and uh, I'll see you guys in a video tomorrow. So, catch you later. Bye-bye.